Hiya, hiya. This is Joey Reynolds. Now, you know, this is my broadcast porch outdoors in Florida. Uh, well, you probably notice it's nighttime, and there's a, it's a special broadcast tonight because I want to I wanna talk about something that's very, very timely. On 60 Minutes tonight, they showed the horribleness of the Ukraine, of course, which is what we have been following. But later on, they had a kid on there who... Uh, uh, is started in, in, I think, Arkansas. He dropped out of college and he started with a bullhorn walking up and down the street saying, birds aren't real. So he started a campaign that birds aren't real. And the, the whole thinking is that uh, birds are spying on us. They are put there by the government. And they even hang around on wires so that they recharge on all of the, all of the high wires that we have. <laughs> <laughs> it's so it's goofy and it's so obscene and absurd absurd that I you know I've been working with birds for a long time and usually uh, I, I've been tweeting like crazy because my bird the the good bird that was my co-host last year passed away but I adopted an owl and I figured I'll be on at night because owls are on at night right no yeah they they work at night don't they don't they work all at night time. <laughs> Owls are not real. <laughs> birds are not real. Matter of fact, if you live in Florida, you probably have the early bird special, which is not real. <laughs> the prices are unreal. <laughs> so I'm, I'm, I'm on that page with this kid that started this thing, and they put it on 60 Minutes. You know, I mean, uh, that was like 60 Minutes turned into Saturday Night Live all of a sudden, and it got me excited. So much so that I come out here and I said, wow, you know, well, this is great that we are actually opening up on, on television to get people who are, he said, he's like, what, must be 22 years old or something like that. Getting young people to watch television again, regular TV has uh, been, it's very annoying, you know, to have everybody run away from the radio and the TV, which I was so famous on for, at one time and also so much in love with. But now, you know, I call it Marconi's child. And uh, Marconi was the inventor of radio, incidentally. So uh, an Italian from Jersey, all right, come on. Uh, so we, we have a different kind of a world right now, and, and we're using electronics, and we, we have fear-based thinking from all that's going on with the enemies, with the Russians, and whoever we're at war with at this point. And we have all kinds of theories and, 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 and scary thoughts and you can't sleep, you, you, you get nervous, you think that, uh, you know, you want to protect your family, you want to protect your life. Like today, I went out and I bought a pork chop, I thought I was buying a house for the price that it was. But you know, this is the way it is, where prices are so high, and the gasoline, and, and the war, and I wanted to come out and, sell, and tell you that owls are not real. <laughs> They're not real. Birds are not real. That kid's right. And they are spying on us, too. And, Pigeons, oh my God, that's why there's so many of them in New York, you know. Uh, if we could only acquire a taste for them, they would be so delicious. Cause, now, that, that's terrible, isn't it, to say that? I mean, you know, to think about eating a bird. Yeah, isn't that a, a chicken a bird? I don't know. But I remember when I was a kid, we had Chicken Man on the, on the radio. <laughs> this whole bird thing made me crazy. <laughs> So uh, uh, the, the, the idea of putting this on television, on a show like 60 Minutes, which is a routinely serious conservative show, and then having something that's goofy just sparked me. And I'm saying, well, finally, they woke up. They know that we got to have some fun. And so this is like putting TikTok long form on 60 Minutes. That's what it was like doing. So tomorrow uh, when I, I get up, See, I could run this right now on the West Coast because of the time difference. They haven't seen 60 Minutes in California yet. Let's see, what time is it here? It's uh, 9 o'clock here. They're just starting. Yeah, they'll see it in another hour. So they can see this and then be inspired. So if you're on the West Coast and you're watching this, uh, you'll be able to see 60 Minutes tonight on a Sunday night, and you'll see what I'm talking about at the last story on Birds Aren't Real. And it's, I love the idea that we got a young guy who's having fun, and he's crazy, and it's going to make him a superstar, and they'll make a movie out of it. And we haven't had anybody like this since probably Howard Stern or Imus or even Rush Limbaugh was about politics. I got famous, uh, oh, my God, so long ago. <laughs> it was, I'm, a, I, I'm having a second life. <laughs> I'm going to come back again. <laughs> 
but I have to leave first, don't I? All right, so tomorrow morning, let us smile over your umbrella. Don't get a mouthful of rain.